In the previous video we created a search input and made a search request using Mapbox to populate results based on the user search value. In this video we're going to look at how to handle errors from our API correctly and also what to do if we have no data returned from our API based on our search query. Now currently within this function get search results we have this get request here which is reaching out to the geolocation API and returning us results based on the user search query. However if this endpoint errors out we have no way to handle this. So to fix this we can use what is called a try catch block. Now after our if statement here we can define try and then we want to wrap our request here and also where we set our data inside of this try block. So we'll copy this and then we'll paste it inside of here. Then after this try block we want to define a catch block and this is where we can handle all the errors. Now for this application we're going to keep it very simple. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here to where our variables are stored and we're going to create a new variable and we're going to call the search error and set equal to a new ref with the initial value of null. And within our catch block if we have an error that is caught then we're going to say search error dot value and set this equal to true. And now within our UL, we're going to create a paragraph tag to output a message if we have an error. So we'll use a VF directive here, and we're going to say if search error is true, then show this paragraph tag. And for the contents here, we're going to say, sorry, something went wrong, please try again. Now another thing we need to account for is no results found based on a user search query. So what we're going to do for this is create an additional paragraph tag and we're going to have another vif directive here and we only want to show this if we don't have a server error and also if the mapbox search results dot length is equal to zero meaning no results were found. And for the content of this paragraph tag we'll say no results match your query try a different term. Now we only want to show this paragraph tag if we don't have a server error and the mapbox search results dot length is equal to zero. Otherwise we want to show our li with the v4 loop and vice versa. Now we just can't use a v else directive and a v4 directive on the same element. So what we need to do is actually wrap this li tag in a template tag and we'll do that with Emmet wrap with an abbreviation and then we'll wrap this with a template tag and then we can specify a v else directive on here. And now inside of our application, if we attempt to search something that doesn't exist, you're going to see we get a message telling us that no results match your query, try a different term. And if we remove this and type in something like Ohio again, we still get all of our results here.